Hello everybody, today in front of me I have Nokia C21 Plus and in this video we would like to demonstrate that you can set up the parental controls function or feature on this device. So first of all you gotta launch settings, then enter the Google category over here. After that make sure that no accounts are currently linked to your uh, well system, to your smartphone. Uh, so unlink them and uh, after that relink the, the Google account that you will use as the child's account. I will not do that because in my case the uh, proper account is already associated with the device. That's the account that I will use as the well, child's Google account. So from here go for the parental control section over here, tap on the blue get started button, choose child or teenager option. Next. Now we will wait for a little bit. Already, so something went wrong somewhere. So we'll just relaunch the process. Click on the next button once again. Already, now we talk. And we have gotten thrown out of the process for some reason. So we'll relaunch the parental control setup. Do it once again, whatever, this phone is kind of bad and kind of low on the low performance side of things, so it might occur, for some reason it still occurs till now, which is a very strange thing, if you'd ask me. So already, whatever, I'll try to remove the account first, see if that will help, because regularly it should not be the case at all. So I've removed the account, we'll start the parental control setup once again. So we will, uh, on this step, enter the credentials for the child's Google account. It is also worth mentioning that a uh, child has to not know the password, uh, otherwise they will be able to turn off the parental controls fairly easily, I bypass it, so you don't, do not want that for sure. enter the child's account credentials so next step on the I agree button and then accept choose the account that we have just added from the list which consists of this only account Alrighty, next finally uh, we can enter the parents account or the Google account that will be supervising the child. So I'll enter those credentials off the screen real quick as well. Now you can uh, learn some of the features and options this uh, parental controls feature or well, <laughs> function has to offer, then scroll the page all the way down and confirm the account uh, linking by entering the password to the child's Google account. So let me already, <laughs> sorry, let me uh, do, that, do that off the phone, off the screen real quick once again. Next, tap on the uh, allow option over here. Wait until parent and child's accounts will be linked together. Then click on next button. Here you can uh, prematurely disable the apps that you would like your child not to have access to. You will be able to do that later on as well, so as for right now you can skip it for the sake of uh, finishing the setup process quicker or sooner. Then you can also configure the uh, content filters and restrictions, which you will also be able to do early uh, later on as well. Now if the phone, if the device that is uh, written in Bolt font over here is the one that you will use for supervision, you can uh, install uh, choose the 
install family link button over here and the needed app will be automatically downloaded and installed to your uh, parents device uh, in my case it is uh, not true so i'll just forcefully finalize the installation now i'll take the uh, phone that i'm going to use for supervision then go to the play store in here type in family link just now uh, tap on a green install button and wait for the app to get downloaded and installed respectively now we can go ahead and launch it and from here we can start uh, configuring the parental controls for our child set up the content restrictions, app limits, monitor the app activity and what's not. So first of all, let's just choose the super, supervisor's account that you, we are going to use. As you can see, the, our Nokia C11 Plus is being uh, displayed right over here. We can lock the device, play sound, set up the data limit for it to be used. Then uh, set up the downtime, Configure, configure the app limits and monitor the app activity as well. Manage content restrictions, account settings and devices. Alrighty, so that will be it as far as setting up the parental controls on the Nokia C21 Plus smartphone goes. Thank you so much for watching, thank you so much for your attention and bye bye.